Moving on to Alex Albon, you've praised the job that he's yeah. done for you guys this year. What are the chances of him racing in the Red Bull family next year, or would you be supportive of him racing elsewhere? Yeah, we'd be supportive of him racing elsewhere. I hope that um, you know Mercedes don't prevent that from happening. You know, he deserves that chance. Um, so uh, you know we're doing our best to, to help him, and we'll see what happens. Is that what the situation is at the moment? That it, perhaps Mercedes are preventing him from doing that? Um, you know, there's some obstacles to, to, to get over, but hopefully we can, uh, we, we can achieve that. He, you know, he's a driver, I think, that deserves a, you know, a seat in Formula One and, um, you know, Red Bull, we're doing our best to support him to achieve that. Some really nice words to say about George yesterday. Called him the future, said he would thrive in a Mercedes environment. What's your reaction when you hear Lewis speak like that? A world champion talking. He stands above all things that are being said in the media. He has a clear opinion and it shows that uh, not only on track, but um, let's say uh, looking beyond the tip of your nose, he's one of the few that can actually do that. Now moving on to uh, some comments Christian made just earlier to me. He said that they're pushing to get Alex Albon in at Williams. He said there were some obstacles. He suggested there might be some blocking. What, what are your thoughts? I think it's the ordinary course of business. It, uh, Williams has a Mercedes engine and that is that is clear, and we have Nick De Vries, a Dutch driver that um, deserves to be in, in Formula One equally. Although with him, I'm in two minds. He won us the Formula E World Championship uh, just most recently. So, yeah, I guess this is uh, two uh, uh, groups, interest groups that just have to find a solution. How likely do you think it will be that we'll see Nick in F1 in a race seat next year? Uh, I, I don't know. I think the great thing with Nick is that he has two options. He has the guaranteed seat in Formula E, which is a really um, tough championship and on the other side uh, the maybe 50-50 chance to be in a Formula 1 car. And it, I, you know, knowing you Toto, it doesn't seem like it's your style to be blocking anything anyway. I would never block um, someone like Alex Albon. He's a fantastic uh, guy, uh, personality is, is, is great. Uh, I was personally sad to see him going and um, if he has a chance driving in a Formula 1 car, you know, that's, I think that's the right thing to do. Um, but equally, maybe Nick has. So we need to look at the open spaces um, at Alpha and, uh, and at Williams and try to find a solution.